Welcome to my first ever playthrough of The Witcher 3. I can't believe I still haven't played this one as someone who has thousands of hours in Skyrim. I did get distracted by Skyrim previously. But we are here to start this one. It is day one. We just watched the trailers. I am hyped. I'm ready. I have not played any of these games before. I just bought the audiobook to start getting into uh, the whole universe and stuff. And I've watched season one of the show a while back. But that's about it. It's time to hop on into the universe, start the game, and do this. Let's get to it. Here we go. Not the horse. Well, it's a clue now. Hmm. Okay. a battle. Okay, so this is where we're starting out. What are we doing here? Game is beautiful. Cinematics look lovely. Yeah, it's an impressive cutscene. Oh, zap. Okay. Oh, oh, not the beak. Oh no. It's <laughs> Caramoran Witcher Keep, Banks of the Gwenlech. Might need to move my camera up just a little bit. Oh my, hello, Geralt. Nice to meet ya. Getting, getting personal. Oh, okay, yep. Yeah. Um, is you know I don't find that amusing. Welcome, 
It wasn't meant to amuse, but to prod you to hurry. It's midday already. You promised Siri you'd train with her. Go before Vesemir bores her to death with those etchings. Oh my. Yeah, of course. I... Just hurry up, haha. So, later then. Hmm. See you later. Huh. Oh. Oh my. Oh my. Okay, thank you for the extra extra focus. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Hi, Dio. Did you have to see too? Welcome. There you go. Front row seat. Oh. Oh, he's looking. Oh, he's looking. <laughs> Dio, be, be respectful. Tutorial. The tutorial will introduce the game's core elements. Each, me each message will be saved in the glossary, where you'll also find detailed information about world lore and gameplay mechanics. Okay, perfect. Minimap and objectives. The upper right hand corner display shows your current location, surrounding area. You'll find objectives for your active quest. Okay, I'm gonna have to figure out where to put my camera here that makes the most sense. So we will figure that out. Yennefer, all right. Use my witcher senses. Ooh. You're running out of juice. I know. You might bring me some more once you're done training. Okay, so we need to go train. Let's do that. Thank you all for being here and for joining me on this wonderful, wonderful journey of a new game. Okay, witcher senses. Anything else? I can extinguish the fire. No, that's kind of rude. She already told me to go, so I feel like I'm just gonna go. I got a key. And lilac and gooseberries, of course. Geralt, stop fingering my toilet Oh, trees. excuse me. Okay, I, I'll leave your stuff alone. to sleep. Ciri's disappeared somewhere, of course. Game looks beautiful. Especially on the new monitor and everything. Like, oh my gosh. Guess she prefers practice to theory. I appreciate mm. the next-gen update. Why? Time to wake up, master. These lessons so boring they put you to sleep too? Damn it. Had her taking notes on ghouls and owl ghouls. Wanted to rest my eyes a bit. <laughs> Making her slog through that brick? No wonder she took off. <laughs> John of Bruges lacks flair, true, but he's reliable. Not like the hogwash they print nowadays. She's tackling the pendulums, right? How many times do I have to tell her? Don't train alone. It only embeds your errors. Bring our young damsel to the lower courtyard. She wants to practice, she'll get to practice. Hmm. Um. Yeah, don't be mad. Don't get mad at her. Why the hell not? The whippersnapper refuses to do as she's told. Yeah, well... You like that about her? <laughs> Fine. I suppose I'm partly to blame. But this has to end. Now. Killing monsters is not something to be taken lightly. 
Siri must understand that if she's to become one of us. I'll see you below. If she's to become one of us, hmm. Wrong. Now I see why you were so eager to practice. Strike. She recovers. You're not in a circus, pirouette. <laughs> Wrong. Footwork. Enough. Get down. Train right, or what don't train it? at all. What do you think? All right. Take off the blindfold. You've got work to do. Your reflexes are still slow. Maybe for a witcher. Think drowners or striggers will go easy on you because you haven't undergone the mutations? Though in your shoes, I'd fear Vesemir more than any strigger. Disobeying his instructions? So she's unwise. gonna be a Okay. Well, yes, but that book was horribly dull. I know. And you know that's no excuse. <sighs> I'm sorry. It won't happen again. Better not. Better not. Vesemir said if it does, he'll make you eat a bowl of slugs covered in salt. <laughs> you! Exactly. Point taken. Yep. So you'd best behave. Come on, we'll practice with the others down below. Shall we run the walls? All right, tutorial time. Let's do it. Of course. This a witcher school or an elven bathhouse? To the bottom. <laughs> Maybe if you fall. Yeah, I do wish that the uh, show had what followed. What did I tell you about breathing? The games Through your are mouth, in rhythm with your steps. <sighs> Siri, cut it out. We don't need a ladder. Oh, am I supposed to be using my witcher senses to find something? I don't think there's anything to find yet. Pretty flowers. Run into trouble. Should I turn back and help you? Try to make fun of me. First. <laughs> na, 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 na. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know about that. You want you want me to win? I'll win. I was letting you win. Wait, where did she go? Oh, she's gonna win now. Oh, she super won. I went the wrong way. <laughs> oh no. Vesemir's got that look. What did you expect? <laughs> What's that look? Anything to say for yourself, young lady? I'm very sorry, Uncle Vesemir. Young blood craves action, I understand that. But when you fight a beast, knowledge counts as much as your silver sword. At the very least, you ought to be able to tell a ghoul from an owl ghoul. By markings, like unto the panthera tigris that in Zeracania dwells, and by the sickly paleness of its visage. Hmm. <laughs> so you did read the chapter. Still, you should have asked if- But you were asleep, Uncle Vesemir. Oh? Oh? So you did the reading. Why not admit it right off? Never pounce on an advantage as soon as it appears. 
Wait till it stands to have maximum effect. Hmm. Uncle Vesemir's words. Okay. Well, you're a quick study. Quick, but mischievous. Fine, we've talked enough. Geralt, you're with me, Lambert with Eskel, Siri with a dummy. Again? Stop groaning and grab a sword. What do you think? Should we start by reviewing the fundamentals or go right to free training? Hit me with the tutorials. Come on. Should work on the basics. Even skilled masters need to hone the fundamentals. And Ciri's barely a novice. Never seen anyone intentionally let her win before? I don't know. She was she was hyped. <laughs> Draw your sword, Garrett. Quick and painful. Okay. Witchers must be prepared to fight foes of all kinds, be they plate-clad knights, ethereal wraiths, or bone-crushing giants. To match the strengths and exploit the weaknesses of different enemies, witchers need to use a variety of weapons and combat techniques. The core tools of their trade are their swords, one steel for fighting humans and non-humans, the other silver for slaying monsters. Witchers also have mastered a simple form of combat magic. These signs are not as powerful as the spells wielded by mages, but they can be cast very quickly with simple one-handed gestures, making them quite useful in the heat of combat. Witchers are also adept in basic alchemy. They can brew powerful potions, blade oils, and bombs, all of which give them a keen advantage when fighting stronger or faster foes. Okay. When you have a target selected, all your attacks are directed toward it. You don't have to select a target, but it can help. Quick cuts! One, two, three! How do I know? Okay, that's how I know. When it's, there it goes. What the blazes are you doing? Not too late to surrender. Give it all you got. Never lock your elbow when striking, young lady. Is this like Bloodborne that uses X and Y for the Footwork. Remember. Oh, I was hitting B, not A. Oops. I'm like, why is it not? Now, Harry. Siri, She's like see how Geralt holds his ah. sword, its angle? What am I supposed to parry? If I did a stupid job. Pretend now, live later. Repost! Strike! Counter-strike! Ah. Maybe a storm's coming. <laughs> Slice your jugular! Okay. So you can just block or you can actually parry. Now, oh, young lady. Bring the day to a close, we'll go over a few witches signs. Let's a start Quen with Quen sign? Okay. Quen. Siri. Oh. Quen, Siri. Quen is sometimes called the witch's shield. Now watch carefully to see why. Oh. Cast Igni, Geralt. I want to see sparks fly. If not for the Quen sign, I'd be aflame by now. All right, okay. Geralt. Come on. Ooh. See that, Siri? Ard will knock anyone. Come on. Oh, that didn't really quite work. Time for Axie. Damn it. Okay. I hate this feeling. Yeah. Uh, Axie can really muddle your mind. Interesting. Heard her now. Show her, girl. What does this one do? A magic trap. See this, Siri? Couldn't move if I wanted to. Oh, come on. Throw a bomb. Don't worry, Siri. Quen will dampen the blow. Ah, press R. Okay. Okay. Throw it there. Oh, I see. No, I'm supposed to throw it like. 
Oh, I can hold it and aim. Got it. Got it. I'm like, wow. Cool. Fine. Enough. Continue training at will. Okay. Oh, okay. I rude. I sheathed my sword. He didn't care. Whoa, you really showed him, kid. <laughs> Siri, get down here. <laughs> A little she devil. As soon as she's back, we'll set her to polishing all the swords at Care Moorhead. Find that helmet? Siri? Make sure to find every last blade for you. What the? Hmm? Is that a person? You all right? <laughs> Had a nightmare. About? Got it. Okay, so all that was the dream. Cool. Take forever to explain. Dawn, some way off. We've got time. I mean, yeah, let's talk about it. Sure. Started in the guest room at Kaer Morin. I was relaxing in a tub and next to me... Tris? Yennefer. Funny, isn't it? She's never been there. Seems so real in my dream, though. Hmm. Was she nagging you about something? <laughs> mm -hmm. True to life, indeed. We'll find her. I know we will. That's not what worries me. You've seen her tracks. She's at full gallop all the time. Breakneck speed through wildlands, devastated battlefields. She's in a hurry to get somewhere, or fleeing something. Either way, it means trouble of some sort. Be surprised if she wasn't in trouble. She's mm -hmm. always poked her Why? nose in beehives. Courtly intrigues here, mages' conspiracies there. What do you expect? Don't know. Guess I thought once we were finally reunited, things would be calm, at least for a while. Calm? With Yennefer? <laughs> Good luck. Okay, so they're giving us some, like, details about Yennefer. It's interesting. In the dream, I went and found Ciri. Then we trained. Those were the days. Mm. Little she-devil. I've trained kids who were faster, stronger, but none had her character. Hmm, so what happened? Didn't end well, did it? Your dream. No. A wild hunt appeared, attacked Ciri. I couldn't move, stood there like a stump. Not a stump. It was just a dream. That's the problem. It was more. 
In the past, when Siri would appear in my dreams, something was wrong. She was in danger. We taught her how to defend herself from anything, wraiths included. Be dawning soon. Time to go. Wait. Show me the letter from Yennefer. Might have overlooked some hint in there. Didn't overlook anything. We were meant to meet in Willoughby. That's what she wrote. Meanwhile, one army or another burned the village to the ground. All we can do is follow her trail, oh, so... Stop okay. talking for a minute and give me the letter. Oh, how about that? It does smell of lilac and gooseberries. You were gonna read it, not sniff it. <laughs> we must meet soon. Willoughby near Vizima. Hmm. Nothing else to guide us there. What's this postscript? I still have the unicorn? That's pre- Okay, no, I have to know. Please, please explain. Stuffed unicorn. Used it once or twice. In certain situations. Okay, maybe I didn't need to know. Maybe mm. I didn't need to know. The uh, things young uh, folk get up to these get days. Young Back people on these days. <laughs> How's it look? How far behind Yennefer are we? Two or three days. Trail's fresh. But it looks like it leads towards the main road. Could be muddled there. Wait, hear that? I hear it. I smell it. Ghouls. Okay, alright. Life on the continent and in the Skellige Isles is nasty, brutish, and short. War lays waste to the land, and those it spares live in fear of the countless monsters lurking outside every town and village. Monsters are shown with a silver health bar above their heads, indicating that you should fight them with your silver sword. <laughs> Flashy slash. Yes. Ah. No. Okay, I need to be parrying. Oops, that's not quite parrying. Nope, that's not quite it. Not how long you're gonna make me wait. Okay, we're getting there. We're getting there. We're figuring it out. We're figuring it out. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna have to learn the parry timing. That's gonna be the main thing. Striking opponents generates adrenaline points. Certain abilities you can acquire allow you to perform special attacks that require and consume adrenaline points. Okay, I also wasn't using our, like, magic. Your adrenaline points slowly decline when you're not engaged in combat. Okay. Of course, when armies pass, necrophages follow. Let's go before any more show up. You can regenerate vitality by eating or drinking or by meditating for at least one hour. Okay, uh, food and drink can be placed in your consumable slots. Up or down, got it. You have some food. And you can double press. Where is my horse? That one. Ever tell you about this sorcerer I knew? Couldn't stop talking about how useful they are as creatures. Was there like loot? Witchers spend most of their time on the road in search of their next contract. They must trek across wide valleys, climb over high mountain peaks, and trudge through thick bogs. Luckily, Geralt can always count on his horse, Roach, to help him in his travels. Ooh, that's not what to press. Okay. Because you can brew potions from their blood? <laughs> no. Because by eating rotting corpses, they prevent epidemics. Can I loot? Did he know they eat the living as well? No. Really upset him, too. His theory collapsed. That's fine. Faster. Let's follow him. War is not exactly going our way. 
we have a side? The Northern Realms. Cutting me off? Radovid's realms, don't you mean? Tamaria and Edirne are no more. Radovid's pledged to restore the old borders as soon as he wins the war. Believe that? <laughs> Gotta believe something. That's what keeps us going. Interesting. No looting from your horse, Scott. We going? Help me! All right, so we're coming up, coming up with a village that was like burned down or something. We're like following a trail of destruction. Oh, okay. Oh, oh. They haven't been very kind to horses so far. Roach, <laughs> stay safe. Stay safe. Are they gonna make him like die tragically? Don't you do that. Uh, oh, 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 uh. The blood dripping. <laughs> Has it gone? Yeah. Come out. Huh. Gods, that was close. I was sure I'd end up like my mare. Provided you got lucky. Your horse died quickly, but griffins like to toy with their prey. Eat it, alive, piece by piece. Oh. Okay. You'd... He's you'd like, like reward, uh, why are you telling me this? Are we... No... We're not gonna start off like that. No, it's fine. We you will don't be... owe us anything. You were in need. We helped. We will be noble. And they call witches heartless. Say they won't lift a finger without pay. They also say mice are born of rotting straw. <laughs> Back to the trail. Like I said, leads to the main road and ends there, muddled. You seek someone. Why is he so eager to offer that? Why? What's it to you? Well, you see, there's an inn here in White Orchard. Soul one around gets its share of travelers. Perhaps you'll learn something there? Besides, the inn keeps my cousin. Tell her Bram sent you. She'll treat you like family. Not a bad idea, especially since that wound needs cleaning. Ah, beast barely grazed me. But sure, could use a good rye, nice and cool, you know, straight from a cellar. Let's go. All right. Cool. Griffins. Half eagle, half tomcat. Hmm. Griffin attack witness. Oh, dear. They would hunt marmots and wild goats. Oh, my. And then... Cows, sheep, and shepherds. Oh dear. Ghouls. It's nice, we'll keep you on the path. So, a griffin this close to the village? Oh, Strange. My thoughts exactly. In the forest or the mountain, sure, but here? Near the main road. Maybe it's the war. Corpses everywhere, the stench of blood, burnt flesh. Drives monsters crazy sometimes. Okay, so I'm assuming I should not speed through the village here. Don't disturb the peace. We will not tolerate theft or accosting others. Uh, but there is notice boards near the settlements. And examine them. Okay. Okay, let's not run anyone over. Not men too. We need to watch ourselves in White Orchard, and we should leave as soon as we learn any. so it were. Except it was some drowner that had supped on the kid. Witcher had naught to do with it. What did the folk do? Say like they could have sewed his head back on. Word is they laid his corpse to rest. Hush, hush, in a crypt. A good story. 
What's the cow cow doing over here? Hello, cow. Making me a slingshot. Gonna hunt the bears. Gonna hunt some bears. Okay, good luck. Goose. Who's crying? Why are we crying? Why why are you sobbing loudly? Coat of arms, the Temerian lilies. They've a right to hang there. This ain't Temeria no more, old man. It's Nilfgaard now. My arse it is. Gonna be a fight or hmm. A lot of tension. What? Witches? I don't know if we're gonna help with this situation. I'll not drink with Weaver Lost Freaks. Beg your pardon for those thugs. No need. We're used to it. Folk are jumpy around here. Armies just passed through. Now a griffin's prowling about. Mm hmm. Already had the pleasure. Ran into your kinsman, Bram. Bram? How is he? Alive. Sends his regards. Master witches. Food and drink on the house. What can I get you? Okay. Let's see what we can do here. Um. Contract on the griffin? There a contract on that griffin? Nay, not at the moment. Used to be. Soon as a beast had built a nest nearby, the alderman would start a collection or go to the lord for help. Now the alderman don't use the privy without asking the black one's permission first. And seems they hanged the lord. So no contract. Shame. We might have done something, but not for free. <laughs> Maybe we would have helped you, right? Pretty busy place you got. Nations on the move. Lively. Some search for kin, others just want to get out of the way of the armies. They all need food, drink, and a night's rest in warmth. So, war's been good for your trade? Aye, so far. But it'd be best to know peace again. Times like these, you never know what tomorrow will bring. Show me what you got behind the counter. Okay. Looking for a woman, raven-haired, violet eyes, dresses in black and white, riding in from Willoughby. And, uh, strange as it sounds, lilac and gooseberries might have smelled that. I've not seen nor smelt such a lady. <laughs> Believe I'd remember. Yeah, especially hard to forget this one. Plenty of travelers about, though. Folk from all over. Might be worth your while to ask after her. Okay. So that's showing us what's going to end the conversation. Cool. Thanks. Well, let's ask For around. Everything. I wish I had nine dumplings too, right? That sounds good. What's for dinner? Mm. It's a cat. Help you bandage that up? Please. I'm not decrepit yet. Then I'll ask about Yennefer. Mm-hmm. Just remember, we'd rather not draw any attention. Okay, be low-key. We're here. Black we one's been out measuring see. the fields. So, Let can I save? That and burning the harvest. Game save, yes. Oh, Drommel. Drommel, you're dumber than a headless cockerel. Why are they marking out them lines, eh? Parcel out their patrimony. Give it to their own. I'm looking for someone. And we seek some peace and quiet. Out of my face, freak. 
for your breath sours my beer. Uh, oh. You'll make use of the Axie sign? It influences people's mind. To charm more stubborn individuals who would otherwise resist during a conversation, invest in the delusion ability in the character panel. Oh my goodness. Just... Uh, should I just leave? Just wanna talk. Just wanna, wanna talk. You deaf, Stray. No one here will talk to you. If it's company you seek, stick that mangy snout of yours in a trough with the pigs. <laughs> <laughs> Show that shit Maybe eater, Micah. Should I use... Should I use... Is this bad? Red woman dressed in black and white. Seen her? Talk. Folks say the lady rode through Is the village bad? a few days back. Galloping so fast she knocked Radabor into a ditch. Which way did she go? Dunno. Lots of tracks leading off the main road. Could have gone anywhere. Boy, people! The freak's taken Micah's uh -oh. mind! Uh-oh, yeah, that's bad. Uh, and I'll take your tongue if you don't shut up. Huh. Okay, so that could have gone better. It... It could have gone better. But, you know, it's okay. Let's have a look around. <laughs> Once more, there are four Can I pet the cat? Four. Oh, the cat does not want anything to do with me. Teams. Okay, never Suits. mind. Similar to clubs and spades, except each suit has its own face cards. There are also special are cards. Good? Wouldn't you rather play war? It's like to be near dawn before you get your game in Minnoggin. Should I talk to them? I don't know if they're going to want to talk to me. Who's this guy? Let me try over here. Hello. Looking for a woman. Uh, like everyone. Not like everyone. And not just any woman. Mine smells of lilac and gooseberries, dresses in black and white. Two schnapsies. <laughs> It'll lift your spirits. Okay. Fine, I'll have a drink. Can we cut to the chase? You seen her or not? Yennefer of Vengerberg. We're a witcher, right? It's fine. I'm assuming. I don't really know. I don't know the rules. I don't know what we can do yet. Never mentioned her name. Yet you described her perfectly. And once I hear something, I never forget. Can't help it. Huh. Um... Yeah, who, who are what you? What do you do? Who are you? A mangy vagrant. Gone to Rodim at your service. Vagrant? That a profession now? Once a merchant of mirrors. The madding crowd dubbed me Master Mirror, or the Man of Glass. How do you know Yennefer? What a question. Master Dandelion's ballads, of course. The only way a humble merchant might hope to rub up against greatness. Unless, that is, he's as lucky as I am. And runs into a very patient witcher. Into <laughs> Geralt of Rivia himself. The Butcher of Blaviken. Recognize me from Master Dandelion's ballads, too? To your health. Huh. You seen Yennefer? Deepest apologies, but I must ask. Is this about love? I don't know. Right? Like, is that his business? Not his business. None of your business. Yes. As a vagrant, I deserve no explanation. What do you know? Tell me. Before you appeared, it never occurred to me that might have been Yennefer. Who would have thought? Uh -oh. Get to the point. An elf guardian scout from the local garrison saw her. Where? At their camp. She rode in there. Dark of night, black and white, gooseberries and... Yes, I know. Had a terse exchange with the garrison commander and raced off. Where to? <laughs> I'm not omniscient. Ask at the garrison. Thanks. 
We men of the road must stick together. Perhaps one day I'll be in trouble and you'll be nearby to help. Huh. That's interesting. So I see that there's... Oh, the cat does not want me near. Oops. So this is our stash. Cool. Understood. Anything in there? Let's go. Okay, so our horse is outside. Done drinking. Mm -hmm. Then fuck off. <laughs> Don't want your kind here. Uh, okay, this is when I might want to use my mind powers. I don't know if I should fight them. I don't think that looks very good. But I also don't know if using my mind powers looks the best. Um, we could try to, to resolve this peacefully, but I don't know if that will work. I'm just, I'm gonna use magic to deal with things. I'm a witch. <laughs> I haven't done anything to you, so just calm down. Of course no. I, uh, you've done nothing. Horses work in witchcraft. Get him! Uh-oh. Yeah, that didn't work either. <laughs> Still! Don't run out! <laughs> Ever fight a witcher? Nice meeting you. Okay, well, I only had to fight two of them now. Sorry! Uh, my, my bed. Uh, just passing through. <laughs> yep, save often. Thank you. Ah, so I see it's showing me where I can gather ingredients. On the way to the Lad went missing one day, so I poked Nadda Witchman that was hunting him. There's like a bunch. So I poked him, asked him. Back here. Ah. Okay, so it looks like I'm supposed to go over here. Um, let's just let's just go. I don't think they want go, me go. here. I don't think I'm very welcome. Oh, there's a side quest or something though. In that case, I must meddle. Don't you look at me. I must meddle. What? What happened here? Oh, got a wee bit chilly the night, so I set fire to my forge. Got it nice and roaring. Roasted some wieners. What do you think happened, dimwit? Some bugger set alight me, me workshop. I've lost everything. Oh. Everything! Um, yeah, no, that's, that's rough. Sorry. Sorry. Any suspects? Whole damned village. I've lived here half a century. Thought they saw me as one of their own. But everything changed when the Black Ones came. I'm the only smith around, so I got to service their garrison. Bang dents out of plate, shoe horses. That sort of thing. Nilf guardians don't pay me a bloody copper. Just give me supplies and orders. But humans can't fathom that. They think I'm getting rich off their misfortune. That I sleep on a pile of gold like a plowing dragon. They've stopped talking to me. Spit when I pass. And now this. All right. I can find your arsonist, provided you're willing to pay. <sighs> I've not much left, but I'll give you all if you bring me that horse in, so that he gets what he deserves. The night of the fire, I heard movement outside my hut. Went out to see if I could find any tracks, but found nothing. But then I haven't got cat eyes, have I? Good luck. Luckily, we have cat eyes. Neat. When one of your quests is updated, a notification will appear. Okay, then we can track. All right, let's take a look around. I'm assuming I'm supposed to use my Witcher senses to find something. For clues, what am I not finding? I'm holding down 
Oh, oh, oh. Things from a tinderbox. Red. I see. Arsonist okay. must have Different lit his color. torch here, tossed it on the roof, then fled through the orchard. Damn dear, I've stripped the bark off my trees again. Like investigate. Stinks of piss and vodka. Okay. Where are we going? Going on a journey. I need my horse. We going that far? Maybe. No. Took off his boots and went in the water. Probably wanted to cover his trail. One eternity later. I don't understand. It's not in the circle. Oh my god. Do you call that in the circle? Do you call that in the circle? I don't. I don't call that in the circle. Something jumped out of the rushes. Drowners. But he managed to escape. Tracks lead back to the village. Bleeding, mm -hmm. we'll but not badly. Face Surface wound. Let's follow the footsteps. Had nothing to do with it. What Freak. did the folk do? Like they could have sewed his head back on. Trail ends here, but I'll recognize him by his wounds. Okay, I'm not holding down Witcher senses anymore. There we go. Should I just be looting everything I'm assuming? Uh, hello? Okay. No, maybe not. Hello. Oh, hello. Claw marks. It's gotta be him. Nasty wound. Run into a drowner? What the fuck do you care? Whoa, our arsonist's a charmer too. Come on, Smith wants to talk to you. I ought talk to a non-human. Sons of bitches all, and dwarves are the worst. Greedy little magpies do anything for gold they will. Really? <laughs> they forge the blades the black ones put to our throats. Am I not right? Listen, we can work this out man to man. I give you gold, you don't turn me in. Hmm. My mum died a while back and I sold her tools. Hmm. I've spent some, but what's left is yours. Wow, what a tempting offer. No. Magpies and dwarves might be greedy, but I'm not. Can't buy me. Then I'll beat your fucking mug to a pulp. Oh, really? Are, really? Really? No. Bewitched. Calm down. Now follow me. <laughs> he's, he's gonna come with, I think. Oh, we're not going that way. I, that door doesn't open. I, I gotta apologize. Gotta go. Apologize. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Maybe I should have let him... Maybe I should have beat him up. Maybe... Maybe that's better. Looking for trouble. <laughs> Come on, buddy. Oh, Will you raise a glass with me? It's Durvan now. D-E-R-V-A-N. Not going That lady's more. nice. Well, Can you hurry it up? What do you mean? I know what they named you at your cutting. Jetty! Now listen carefully. You'll Notice never boards. have to sing that rhyme again. Never. And you're not to play with Jetty yeah. no more. <laughs> Don't understand what you just read. No wonder. It's in Nilfgaardian. And soon half the world will be speaking this mysterious tongue. You better start learning it now. And yours truly can help you with that. For a very modest fee. <laughs> There's a war. Help could father in need. Whoever drives the monster away. Like, okay. 
My brother went off. Uh, let's see. A brand brave. Gotta go find the guy. Okay, sure. I want to learn another language. That sounds good. The army? I don't know about that. Hmm. A deserter. And what is this? All able-bodied men must what? The rotting bodies. Oh, littered with corpses. Uh, should I help with that? Or do we pretend we didn't see it? <laughs> you say take them all? Okay, that's fair. Much of interest to be found in the world's dense forest and fog-clad swamps. Whenever you peruse a notice board, markers will appear on your minimap to indicate potentially interesting places. Seek them out to learn what secrets they hold. But Chetty's my best mate! Chetty's a little fool. He'll get us all killed. Hello there. Up and at him. Hmm? What? Uh-oh. What, what's going Maybe on? this isn't the way to handle this. Here you go. One village pyromaniac in the flesh. Nap! You! I knew your mum for years. Charged the nary a copper. This is how you repay me. I've had enough. Hey, soldier. A minute of your time, please. No! Willis, I beg you. I, 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 I was drunk. Didn't know what I was doing. The I was drunk, defense. I've told you, uh, Master Willis. We will help you rebuild compelling. once reinforcements come. The supplies have been ordered. Not what this is about, mate. This here's the arsonist. A witcher found him. The forge was important to the garrison. Destroying it was sabotage. Uh -oh. No trial needed uh -oh. here. Just a tree. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Maybe I, uh -oh. I should have just kicked his butt. <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh. Uh. Yeah, I don't know if that's going to help you make any friends. Villagers will really love you now. Well, no, I don't give a flying fuck about them. <laughs> you know, I okay. hated the black ones at first like everybody else did. Now I'm thinking uh -oh. they might just bring order to uh -oh. this place. Teach these layabouts some uh... manners. But enough about that. Your reward. Hmm. And I managed to save some things from the fire. Anvil still holds, so I'm sure I can bang something out on it. You need anything, let me know. Give you a good price. Well, uh, at least he's our friend. Uh -oh. A return customer. Welcome. Looking at. So we can craft Show stuff? Show me what you got. So, inventory. Quest items. Let's read Yennefer's letter. Dear friend, forgive me for not asking about your health or how you've been these last years. Time is very short. I have important news. We must meet, and soon. Ride to Willoughby, near Vizima. And don't spare the horses. While I do eagerly await our reunion, I won't be able to wait, eagerly or otherwise, very long. Your dear friend, Yennefer. P.S. I still have the unicorn. So how about our map? Jump to your objective, scroll the map, see a mini-map. That's where I'm supposed to go. Okay, so we are just basically supposed to make our way that way. Let's go. Sure. Let go fishing. What do I know? Come on, Roach. Let's go. Oops, that's not the right button. Don't you look at me. Cool, and it will just bring us towards our location. So it looks like I might want to stop and, Faster. yeah, maybe investigate some of these places. I think also, if I look on our world map, what about our side quests? We will just go. Let's see what's over here. See if we want to help. Hello. Lost your key, ma'am? No, not me key. 
me pan. Huh? It's always sat there empty, this hurt. That is, till the night afore the battle. A man arrived, walked right in like to his own. Was standing at me window, peering at the goings on. What? He must have eyed me, cause next I knew, there he was, coming my way. So, I grabbed Oh, this is like a tangled pan, situation, yes. Protection, Rapunzel. But he just asks all polite, Gran, got any birch bark by chance? Lilac berries or even a few coals? Nay, says I. Lilac. And you must be right daft to pester folk at night with such foolery. But I sees he ain't listening. Just staring at me pan like a magpie at a copper. Lend it to me, Gran. I'll give it back come morn. I was right baffled for what's he doing, frying in the dark. <laughs> but I've got a soft heart, so I gave it to him. Uh. Okay, and then what? Interesting. What happened then? A dawn. Another rode up to the hut, but come morn, only the first fella left, locked the door, hopped on his horse, and that were all I saw of him. And no, pan. not the pan. Twere old, black with soot, not worth much, I suppose, but I've no other. Will you help me, dearie? Bring an old widow or a pan. <laughs> I could never break down that door myself. And in truth, I'm a fear to go in any road. Such a stench wafting out. Me thinks uh -oh. the other fellow. Well, uh oh, that he's lying there. Uh oh. All right, we'll help her get a pan. Never taken on a pan contract. <laughs> Fine, I'll go in, look around. A pan. You should wait here, just in case. <laughs> There we go. Break into the locked hut. Okay. Some objects can be destroyed. To destroy objects to open up a path, face them and cast the Ard sign. You can try hacking at them with your sword, but not everything can be destroyed in this manner. Another option is to toss a grape shot bomb. Don't blow yourself up. Cool. I'm and you can switch between things. Got it. Kind of fun. Take diagrams to craftsmen with the proper skills to have them craft the item for you. A corpse explains the stench. His throat. He was garroted. And some old scars. Kind of soldier might have. What's that, dearie? Nothing. Nothing. Hmm. Hmm. Uh. I did destroy Grandma's door. I did. I did. Uh, maybe there was a better way in here that did not involve breaking down the door, but she told me to do it. Ah, uh, the priceless frying pan. Hmm. Scrubbed clean. Oh, he left it clean for her. Looks like the mystery man didn't need the pan so much as the soot off it oh. to make ink write letters. Oh. <laughs> okay. But when I gab to myself, they say I'm going barmy. What? Who are you talking to, though? <laughs> oh, so Documents. Nice almost entirely burnt. A few pieces still legible. Found the pan, have you? And when you arrange to meet, you show up! I did, risking my life and the entire blasted operation, and ended up standing there with my... What? Ended up standing there, waiting for nothing. I thought the Nilfgaardian army was better organized than that, but you... Tell that blessed Lord General of yours that me and my companions don't hold grudges, but so we won't break off negotiations. But since our old plan's gone... awry, this time we'll choose the time and place for our next meeting. <laughs> it looks like whatever they were doing here didn't work out, you could say. As they said, um, perhaps a little less eloquently. Here, your frying pan. 
Oh, yeah, this is yeah. not her house, right? No. Mine were black with soot. And I could see myself in this sun if I wanted. But them years are past. It was the soot the man needed. He scraped it off to make ink. Must have had an urgent letter to write. Urgently burned some other documents, too. And... And the other fellow? Dead. Round up a few boys and bury him outside the village. Deep, so the necrophages don't dig him up. And take my advice. Don't mention this to the Nilf Guardians. Hang about! You've earned a token of thanks. Here, Sonny. For the road. Thank you. Sonny. <laughs> What'd we get? Fry up a nice white fish for supper. Okay, well, I hope she get, has a good dinner. <laughs> How random. Some baked apples. Ooh, I love baked apples. Guarded treasure. Oh. Let's go. Oh. Okay. I want treasure. Ooh. Ah, some treasure. Ah. Oh. Wait, that's kind of fun. Boom. Okay. Do I get my treasure? Diamond dust. You guys, this is going pretty well so far. I'm enjoying this. We're just beginning. Ooh, look at all the swamps. All right, we gotta go save Yennefer, though. Giddy up. I'm assuming. She does need our help. But that much is true. Go on, and Kazel! Take it easy. All right, let's get on foot again. Whoops, nope. Take a look around here with some Witcher. The Emperor shall senses. guide us straight to Novigrad. That's a fast travel point. I don't yes? think they're gonna have anything to say. Nice looking city. Military camp. No locals allowed without the express consent of the garrison commander. I look like a local to you. You look like trouble. Dead wrong. I make trouble go away. I'm a witcher. <laughs> a witcher? Captain Peter Sagwin Levy is in the tower. Turn right, past the gate. Any work? Guessing your captain's got work for me. This is the army, Nordling. There is no guessing. <laughs> to the tower. Go. All right. Stop! All right, we'll go, we'll go. Gold ties, gold yeah, no, we're gonna be playing this game for a while. Northern women, I'll be online like Monday through Friday this week and Asandian most Kalbad. weeks. This is the Nord-Est Ulf Heiden and Meras. It's a and monsters. It's a drug, Meras. It's a tool of Ulf Heiden. Meras, Deich Eden, the Vaan Esseth. It's a Thorden Kyle McHale. It's cool they have him speaking in another language like that. Okay, so I'm, I'm supposed to be asking uh, them. I have my eye on you, Nordling. Yes. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Who's that? Damnation! Hail, Evan, like Evan, we dry. It's a queer and proper not Nag. Nordling. You guys have fun over here. While you cut off a leg, I'm gonna go this way. Wish to enlist, Nordling. Gloire in Ard Fies. We must requisition the share of your harvest. Oh, your excellency. I wanted the stuff. Enhancing weapons. Oh. I know there is little left in your granary. Oh, cool. But soldiers are men too, and so they must eat, correct? Blacksmiths forge weapons, armors make armor. No. Password. Don't know any. So, out for a little walk, eh? Counting the Emperor's swords to lull you to sleep? Well, in the army, we've a place for nosy ramblers. The scaffold. 
And thick skulled quartermasters, they got a place. <laughs> uh, you're clearly skilled at banter. And haggling? You got a knack for that as well. How's the morale? Morale holding up around here? You boys think you can win this thing? Ah, a spy after all. Or one to stir trouble. Neither. No. Just curious. Right. <laughs> well, tell anyone who cares we will win this war, because Radovid is mad. As everyone knows, and we've an extraordinarily well-drilled and well-supplied army. Incidentally, did you wish to buy something? Well, perhaps. Can he craft something? I'd like you to craft something for me. Huh. Okay. How much grain will your village give? Whatever you say, Your Excellency. Look at my hands. Look. See the calluses? These are not the hands of an Excellency, but of a farmer. So we speak peasant to peasant. How much can you give? Forty bushels. There'd be more, sir, but our lads, the Temerians, that is, took from us earlier and... You will give thirty, and that will do. Let us settle on it. And I wish to see the transport soon. Oh, thank you, sir. Thank you kindly. I summoned only the Elderman and the Smith, Willis. But it is said he is a dwarf. You are too tall to be him. Um... Fair en enough? Plan to requisition something from him, too? If it is necessary, yes, of course. We are at war, in case you have not noticed. Who are you? Speak! Geralt of Rivia. Witcher. Vatgarn. This explains why I did not hear your footsteps. Noah? What? what do you seek here? Yennefer of Vengerberg. Where was she headed? That is a military secret. Haven't thrown me out yet. Haven't called the guards. So go ahead. What's your price? There is a griffin in the area. Slay it. And then I shall see what I can do. Why is that your priority? Why do you care about this griffin? Because I care about people. The beast has killed ten already, including a few of my men. Fair enough, to hunt that's it, why. I would need to mobilize the entire garrison, comb the woods, organize a batu. Simply impossible. Too big a hassle? No too high a risk. I cannot disperse my forces. Demeria's army we have crushed, but its common folk remain, ready to answer a call to arms. So, as to this griffin, That's when we I come can in. sit on my hands or hire a professional. Okay. It's a deal. Some questions before I start. Know where the griffin has its lair? It kept to the vulpine woods at first. I sent a patrol there, five young men. A hunter found them two days on. They only recognized them because they wore our plate. Since then, the griffin has grown bold. Attacks in villages, fields, on the main road. Meaning it's abandoned its lair. Gonna have to set a trap. Mm. I judge from your tone this will not be easy. What do you require? Specific herb? Okay. I'll need bait. A specific herb. Buckthorn. Scent should lure the griffin from ten miles off. Buck... Buckthorn? I do not know this. But I am not yet fluent in the common tongue. Mm -hmm. Probably mastered the basics, though. Hands up. Oh. Kill them. Oh. No. First came idioms. Don't play with fire, for example. Oh. Go to Tomira, an herbalist. She lives near the crossroads. She will aid you. Okay. Need more information about this griffin. Its sex. Why it's abandoned its lair. Shall I bring you witnesses? They won't say anything I don't already know. I need to go where your men died. Look around. What's the name of the hunter who found them? Mizlov. 
He has a hut south of the village, very near the wood. Helpful fellow. A little strange, though. Hmm. All right. Tamira and Mislav. Thanks. Es sun Yakton. Thank you. If your current quest has more than one objective, you can choose which one is tracked. Okay, got it. So, we can ask the hunter. So, let's go to the map. So, now we go back this way. So, we probably want to start here. Does that lead us to this one first? Yeah, perfect. But we can technically like fast travel back over here and run this way, but might as well just run down there, you know? And back to Roach, who is waiting so patiently. What a good horse. Uh, I think I'm supposed to be going the other way. Yeah, it had me wanting to go this way first. So let's go through. <coughs> Emperor shall guide us straight to Novigrad. As a yondrain at my care. It's nice that you don't have to steer when you're just going on the path. That's pretty nice. So I'm assuming there's going to be some other little side quests and things around here. Ah, Ooh. Probably check some things out. Like, yeah. Slow help. now. Whoa. What? What do you need? Who are you? Whoa, Master Witcher. Yeah. What? Hi. What happened? Monsters. Monsters from the swamp. Folks said the road was fraught with peril, but I wouldn't listen. Got my comeuppance now. Less moaning, more details. What happened? And how can I help? And remember. I don't work for free. Witcher's code and all. Well, oh, he's like, hmm. Was on my way <laughs> to the Black Ones to trade. Suddenly my horse got spooked, ran clear off the road. We hit a bump. I went flying and the horse and cart rolled on. Then I heard bubbling, neighing, slurping. Something came out from the muck. Devoured Asher, hooves and all. No Poor doubt horses my goods in this are still game. on the cart, but I'm too afraid to go and see. Thought maybe you. I'm most concerned about a little box. Bring it to me. I beg you. Scary, scary place for horses to be. Fine, I'll go. Let you know if I find that box. Where is that? Let me see. So, will it show me my other quests? It doesn't look like it will. Oh, and that was someone in that village? Okay, I'm figuring it out. Uh, that's stench. <laughs> Okay, that's a lot of wolves. Whoa. Okay, ow. Going this way. All right? No. I mean, that's not for our quest, right? So if I go to the world map, our quest is over here. So that's just showing me where wolves are. Got it. 
I know, poor things. But gotta gotta help Geralt defend himself. Where is the thing? There's the thing. Can I there we go. Card Let's tracks. Stand. Rode off into the swamp. Okay, let's see if we can find it. Here's the cart. I like a cart. Carts riddled with arrows. Carts riddled with arrows. Oops. I should take a look around. An arrow. Didn't mention this. That's not what I meant to press. That's the wrong button. That's the wrong button. They're like, you are dying. Okay, I need to stop pressing. Oh, no, Out of the gas cloud. Okay. Ah! Not again. Not again. I mainly meditate to heal. Okay, spamming food and water is not gonna work. Okay. Yeah, so we're just gonna need to fight. I just keep trying to use our Witcher senses to look around for what I need. What do we even need? Maybe to just fight them? What am I looking for? Okay. Uh, I just... Do I need to come back, like, over here? And there's something I didn't do? Like, we already interacted with the horse. What it wants me to find. Oh, there it is. There's the box. Okay. Must be that box he mentioned. Splattered Not with blood. Not very used to how this works. Yeah, Human blood. Doing very good All right. Back to the merchant. Take it slow. Okay, just... Yeah, that seems to be... Probably a good move. Now it looks like, what, we should meditate an hour or something? Sure. Meditation. Oh, and you find the box? Not just gonna give that to him. Yeah, found your priceless chest and someone who looks an awful lot like a cart driver with an arrow through his neck. No dryads in these swamps, and never known a drowner or a water hack to use a bow. So lacking any other suspects, I'm guessing. Watch out behind you. There's nothing behind me. I'm a witcher. I'd have heard it. <laughs> just like I can hear your heart, which is pounding. Like a liar's. Best hope you're a better writer than you are a liar. <laughs> well. Knock the merchant off his horse. Here we go. Oh my gosh. I don't know how to do this. Oh, got him. Got him. <laughs> Gotta get him out of here. 
What are we gonna do with them? Wake up. See, can't run from the truth. Not even on a horseback. <laughs> now who are you, and why'd you attack that cart? Private First Class John Gamer. Temerian 6th Division, 2nd Regiment. Hmm. Disbanded, but still active. Underground, in the woods. That was a medical transport. I'd be damned if it reached the Black Ones. And the medicine. Our lads could use it too. We've many ill among us. You let me go, and they might live and fight once more for a free north. Hmm. I don't know... I don't know enough about the conflict happening in the world to know who I want to support. Seems like it's a bit of a... a bit of a whole situation. Yeah, there's three options here. Like... Because here's the thing, if I give them medicine, then more other people are going to die. It's like, who do I want to die? It's like, thanks. Thanks for making me choose this. Right? No, I support no one, right? Like, I... I think I keep the medicine. I could take him to the Nilfgaardians. That is who we were just talking to and who we're doing a mission for, but... You can go, but I'm keeping the medicine. Nilfgaard will find you and kill you anyways. Why should it go to waste? Oh, damn. Take it. And choke on it. Oh, damn. Okay, buddy, we could have killed you, all right? It is true what they say about witches. Yeah, whatever. Hey -ya. Hmm, maybe I should have helped him out. I don't know, that's a tough one. I, I'm i interested to see how my choices are going to change and stuff as we go through the game and as I learn more. Huh. made it somewhere okay so let's take a look real fast so we need to go ask the hunter where he found the bodies and ask the herbalist about the buckthorn here yes so we need to go get the griffin <sighs> age the witcher here we are today yes <laughs> okay i need a quick stretch break you guys just, I need like five quick minutes. I'll make this a, a quick break because I'm very interested in what's happening right here. And I don't want to interrupt our momentum. So give me just a moment. Dio is so passed out right now. Yeah. <laughs> what a cutie. Okay, give me just a sec. Uh, give me five. I will be right back. Get yourself, uh, I don't know, snack or drink or anything you need. And we'll keep going. <laughs> 